Giselle, thank you. A look at all of this damage. A fire ripped through a tow yard in High Point, destroying cars. The owner says the fire started when criminals were stealing catalytic converters. That's right. The tool they were using sparked, causing the fire. WFMY News 2's Amber Lake spoke to the owner, who says this isn't the first time it's happened. Right, guys, so our ski towing and recovery told me that thieves have cut the fence around this property a few different times looking for catalytic converters to steal. Now they did that same thing last night. Not only do they have a mess to clean up, the company does. They're going to be installing new security measures as well. Of course, my heart immediately sank. A family business. It makes me very sick and hurt to see um, all the cars that my dad had towed down here destroyed. Hit by thieves. A good friend of mine had called and said that the fire department called them and that our lot was on fire. The High Point Fire Department responded to Arsky Towing and Recovery on Porter Street Sunday afternoon. Owner Tiffany Hugart said she was told that someone broke in to steal catalytic converters. Since last year, it's been a pretty big issue. Every few weeks, we're finding holes in the fence and tools and book bags left behind. Hugart says this was her father's business. My father started this business about 15 years ago, and when he passed away due to COVID, I restarted it. It is very upsetting, but I just feel like he is watching and it will, you know, will find the person responsible and hopefully this doesn't happen again. Thieves steal catalytic converters because of the metal inside. According to Carfax, the metals can be melted down and sold for nearly $2,000 per ounce. Yes, that is about the only valuable part that you can take and leave the car running and then steal and get money. It has a lot of metal inside the converter, so that's what the thieves are after to get to the junkyard. Hugart says High Point police are looking into the break in and if these people are caught, the punishment for stealing a catalytic converter is now a felony plus some pretty hefty fines. Hugart says that the impacted cars will likely go to a junkyard. As for the property itself, they plan on installing more security measures, which means more cameras and an electric fence. Live in High Point, Amber Lake, WFMY News 2.